Alright guys, this is going to be test uh, number two of the uh, nose uh, gear. I'm going to try to cycle it up and down, uh, see how well it does. I have uh, uh, finalized the location of NG3 and NG4. They actually uh, drilled and bolted together and it uh, uh, should, should work out alright. So we're going to cycle the gear uh, one time and uh, show you a little bit uh, how things look. Usual setup here, the jumper cables are connected uh, to the rat's nest over there, plus and minus uh, going to the proper uh, leads, and so everything is connected, as I was telling you, see NG3 and NG4 right there, bolted together and attached, attached to the actuator. So. So you can get this to focus. Let's try the gears up right now. I try nose gear down. And it work. There's not any trouble. Let's take a look at it. No problems there. Now we're gonna cycle it up and uh, make sure it retracts properly into the wheel well. Right, back to, we got gear down, green light, and now gear up. That seems to be working. Obviously, since I cut this side, you see the nose gear leg now sticks up above the floor. I'll have to fix and bridge that part later. You can see. But let's look underneath, make sure no gear sticking out. There's a nose gear right there. As you can see, the strut also kind of goes in quite a bit more, about a, I don't know, quarter inch, maybe a little more. So I say the test is uh, successful and uh, we'll just call it a night. Alright guys, well uh, I hope you enjoyed it and I uh, think we're gonna move on to the next task which is to, uh, well finish the nose, we're gonna need to do the floor uh, and the side, the sides of uh, the nose, but uh, we're gonna call this part completed for tonight. All right, thank you.